We present nonlinear model predictive control of a 3D hopping robot, leveraging lead group integrators for dynamically stable behaviors. We model the hopping robot as a two-domain hybrid system. When the robot is in the air, its dynamics are governed by the unconstrained Euler-Lagrange equations. Then, as it impacts the ground, as defined by the height of the foot being zero, the robot undergoes an instantaneous discrete transition given by the momentum transfer equation. It then enters the ground domain where the spring compresses and releases. Finally, as the spring reaches its original length, the robot hits hard stops, initiating another discrete transition and once again entering the flight domain. Because the configuration of the robot is manifold valued, local approximations must be carefully constructed. We model the orientation of the robot via a unit quaternion, which defines a Lie group with the associated quaternion multiplication operation. The Lie algebra is represented by the tangent space at identity and is parameterized by purely imaginary quaternions. Given a trajectory q0 to qn-1, we begin by pulling it back to the identity element via left multiplication by q0 inverse. Then we can reasonably use the log operation to represent the trajectory in the Lie algebra. Our MPC algorithm is represented via the following optimization program, where the decision variable z denotes the state of the robot, including global position, the Lie algebra elements, internal states of the robot, and associated velocities. Equation 1 represents the continuous time dynamics if no impact is expected, and equation 2 the discrete time dynamics when an expected impact appears on the horizon. The MPC block is combined in a multi-rate control architecture in order to maintain the benefit of having a horizon while adding robustness to model uncertainty and computation time. First, the user provides high-level target base poses, which get fed into the MPC layer. The MPC layer passes desired orientations and feed-forward torques to a low-level controller via Wi-Fi, which sends desired torque commands to the onboard ELMO motor controllers. The internal state of the robot is combined with the global position data and fed back into the control layers. Here we see the combined framework and simulation with increased torque limits. First, we observe that the robot is successfully able to reject disturbances of various magnitudes and directions. Here, the red spot on the ground indicates the desired global position of the robot as set by the user. The smaller yellow dots denote the global state that the MPC program plans over its horizon. Next, we test the ability of the robot to track a square trajectory. Finally, to demonstrate the geometrically consistent nature of the method, we command the robot to flip in various directions. The same methodology is employed on hardware, where the robot is successfully able to hop in place.